Okay, the Team Ellie drama will not be avoided. On today's episode, we will talk about the recent Iranian Football Federation election and what it might signify. You know the deal, and you know what time it is. It's time for Team Ellie Talk. There is never a dull moment with Team Ellie, the national team of Iran. Hey everyone, glad you're back for some more Team Ellie Talk. Let's get right to it. There is a new president of the Iranian Football Federation, and his name is Mehdi Taj. Now, this person is no stranger to Team Meli. He was president of the Iranian Football Federation from 2016 to 2019. And why is this news important? Well, rumor has it that Mehdi Taj wants to make a change at the head coach position. And of course, this would mean no more Dragan Skocic. We have to talk about Dragan Skocic. We have no choice. But in my honest opinion, I feel like there are some football experts that are probably suggesting that Dragan Skocic should just resign as head coach of Team Meli. My reasoning is based on the division in the Team Meli locker room. And as we remember, players from Team Osmoon ask for everyone to please support Team Meli during this sensitive time and not to make any changes until after the World Cup. And of course, Team Jahanbash and Tarmi did not agree with this statement and actually labeled the statement as a lie. In simple English, both camps of Team Elite players do not respect Dragan Skocic. Now, going back to what I said earlier, well, Dragan Skocic is obviously not going to resign because he wants to prove the doubters wrong and he feels that he deserves to be the head coach of Iran at the 2022 World Cup in Qatar. Yes. We revisit the obvious. Mehdi Taj is a big fan of Carlos Queiroz, and there are many Iranian football fans that would love to see Carlos Queiroz return to the national team of Iran. And Carlos Queiroz did create some excitement on his Twitter page with this post on August 21st. The truth is that Team Ellie fans love Carlos Queiroz, and almost all of them would love to see him return as head coach of Iran, but of course, there are also some of those fans that really don't want to see the return of Carlos Quiroz's ultra-defensive tactics. But the fact of the matter is, is that ultra-defensive tactics are much better than Dragan Skocic's lack of tactics. Now to finish off this edition of Team Ellie Talk, I must say that I'm still not fully convinced that Carlos Quiroz will return as head coach of Iran. Yes, Carlos Quiroz did share an interesting video on his Twitter account, but I think Dragan Skocic is very well connected to people in the Iranian Football Federation who have a lot of power. And I'm not going to add any more to this, because you're smart enough to figure this out. 